insulin resistance, insulin resistance, insulin resistance. Unfortunately, we heard this too many times in the US, mostly because our diet is pretty poor in general. So insulin resistance is found with patients who have a diagnosis of diabetes. And there's different types of diabetes, but specifically the type two diabetic, when the diet is so poor, the body gets so overworked that our insulin, which naturally is what our pancreas releases when we eat some sort of carbohydrate. So whether it's bread, rice, pasta, candy, sodas, the way that our body draws the sugar out of our bloodstream is by using insulin. But unfortunately, too many times people are overeating. And so our pancreas is like overworking, especially if you're not very active and very sedentary then the blood sugar pretty much stays in the system and in the bloodstream and our body doesn't do a good job of getting rid of it. And so essentially all the sugar in the blood damages every single organ you can think of, like kidney disease and heart disease. It's the number one reason for reversible blindness, reasons for amputations. And so it's a pretty devastating disease. And the best treatment, believe it or not, aside from just eating healthier can also be movement. Exercise is one of the best things for insulin resistance. But at the end of the day, whatever you put in your mouth, is what you are. So you are what you eat. And if you're interested in what is a healthy diet, we'd be glad to help you out here at Purpose Lately.